Yo, what's up guys, it's your boy, I'm Nick Ark here, welcome back to the channel. In this video, I'm here to explain to you guys and show you guys that the Fortnite clickbait live streams will never ever end. So I hope you guys enjoy this video, if you do, let me know by dropping a like on it, and make sure you guys drop a like on this video, because the more likes we get on the video, the more likely people will know about the information, because I want to share this information with everybody possible, so make sure you drop a like on the video, if you haven't already, and guys, let me know down below in the comments as well, who do you think is the worst Fortnite clickbaiter? Is it Pack a Puncher? Is it Lispy Jimmy? Is it Ghost Ninja, anybody like that, anybody I haven't mentioned, let me know your thoughts on that down below. In the comments, without further ado, it's Winnick Arg, and let's get right into the video. Alrighty guys, so real quick, if you want to support me one step further, make sure you go to your Fortnite item shop, type in code I'm Nick Arg, no spaces, and then send me a video or picture over on Twitter, Instagram, or Discord that you bought anything with my code, or that you need item shop in general. I really appreciate it guys, you don't understand, I want to thank you guys in every way possible, because you guys have done so much for me. Without further ado, it's your Winnick Arg, let's get actually into the video, my bad about that. So I know what some of you guys are probably thinking, you're thinking, Nick, why are you making a video on Fortnite clickbait live streams when legit yesterday you made a stream called Loot Lake Event happening right now? I made that stream to experiment with the algorithm of the streams and see how well it would actually do. If you guys didn't notice, I put Oh My God in the title and then it's a joke in the title, by the way, because I didn't want anybody to take the stream seriously and people took it seriously. And by taking it seriously, I know most, if not everybody in that stream thought it was a joke and everything, but there's always that one person out of the crowd who actually thought this stream was real, then was real, everything like that. And it's just sad. It makes me sad a little bit. And just keep in mind, if I never said the stream was clickbait, if I never said I was joking, if I never said anything like that, people would think it's real, people would think it's legit, and people would want to enter in the giveaway. And the thing is, I actually hacked into the YouTube algorithm. If you guys don't know, my friend Lion, and I said this on stream, but if you guys weren't there, he went into a random live stream, a random clickbait live stream, and people were spamming mod, mod, mod in the chat. Because I guess he said, whoever can spam mod the most in the chat will become the next moderator. So I decided to try that, and it turns out, I did get him recommended because everybody was spamming mod, but turns out I didn't give anybody mod, obviously, because I don't give mod like that. But it turns out people will be doing this to get into recommended, to get more money, to get more views, to clickbait people, to get more likes, everything like that. And this is why Fortnite clickbait streams will not stop. And throughout the stream, I was doing like a fake giveaway. Like, if you guys want to win a $10,000 V-Buck gift card, all you gotta do is drop a like on the stream. Make sure you subscribe to the channel. It was fake. I even said at the end of me saying that sentence that it was fake. Throughout the whole entire stream, I said it was clickbait. But yet, people still fell for it. Because people like Pack a Puncher, people like Lesby Jimmy, people like Ghost Ninja, everybody who does clickbait live streams are growing so much, gaining so many subscribers from these streams. And if someone else who's a lower subscriber count sees someone else gaining a lot of subs from doing this, wouldn't they want to do it themselves? Like, I'll show you guys a screenshot right now. It says new Greasy Grove event happening right now, and it was on trending for gaming. So between going on trending for gaming, getting millions of views, thousands of subscribers, and thousands of dollars, why would somebody want to stop doing these clickbait live streams if all they're doing by themselves is benefiting from it? And I'm not even going to go in depth with the gifting system. I'm not even going to touch that topic. But that's all I have for you guys in this video is just letting you guys know why Fortnite clickbait live streams will never end. If you guys enjoyed this video, any way, shape, or form, I appreciate it if you guys drop a like on it. And let me know your thoughts on this down below in the comments. And as well, who do you think is the biggest Fortnite clickbaiter? Is it Ghost Ninja? Is it Backup Puncher? Is it Lispy Jimmy? Is it Tamashi Games? Let me know your thoughts on that down below in the comments because I want to hear new faces that I haven't heard of before. Without further ado, if you guys made it this far into the video and you're not subscribed yet i don't know what you were doing you made it to the end of the video make sure with that big red button there to subscribe without further ado it's your winner gargan i'll talk to you guys in a couple hours with a brand new stream or a brand new upload i'll see you guys there and i cannot wait peace